versus girl, girl versus guy. This Seamus and Annie's battle of the sexes on Lafayette's country leader, K105. 819, time for Battle of the Sexes on K105. Susan's back with us for day number two. She ended up losing on Friday, but uh, Susan, how are you doing today? I'm fabulous, Seamus. How are you? Oh, I'm doing good. I'm doing really good. I don't know if I'm fabulous, but I'm uh, fair to partly good. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, we, uh, we also have Bob on the line. Bob, what's going on with you today, buddy? Not much. Not much. Okay. Well, let's see what we can do about that. Uh, three questions for Susan that Bob should know. Three questions for Bob that Susan should know. And we start with Susan because on Friday, wah, 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 she ended up being uh, second place. Here's your question, Susan. Which team is up two games to one in the NBA Finals? Is it the Bulls? Okay. The what? I'm ready. Oh, okay. Is it the Bulls, the Mavericks, or the Heat? Okay, famous. Are you ready for this? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm too, I am couldn't be more ready. They're preparing for game four. It was the Miami Heat over Dallas, 88 to 86. Oh, uh, Bob, are you scared now? One, game check, I win. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's one question, right? All right, now make the other ones harder. No, I'm kidding. No, that's good. That is exactly right. The Miami Heat up two to one. Here we go, Bob. Your first question. <laughs> Bob, who played the Ghost Whisperer on CBS? Was it Sarah Michelle Gellar, Jennifer Love Hewitt, or Melissa Joan Hart? Uh, the second one. Hewitt. Yes, you're correct. Nice work. Do you want to give any more details or information? Yeah, no, I'm no kidding. <laughs> uh, here we go. <laughs> one to one. Susan, your second question. What year did the movie Rocky come out? Was that 1976, 1978, or 1980? Oh, gosh. Yeah, I know. Hey, it's Monday morning for crying out loud. It, it is Monday morning, and I am crying out loud. Um... <laughs> Wow. 76, 78, or 80? What year did it come out? 78? No, 76. That was oh. what you yeah, guessed yeah, that, guess too. Yeah, that, too. Yeah. Oh, you, Bob didn't even know that. You bet. It doesn't matter what Bob knows. Bob, here's your... <laughs> it does right it's now. It's one to one. Here's your second question, Bob. Mm, oh. Bob, shallots are what? Onions, a type of sunflower, or a type of grape? Onions. Yeah. They are onions. Here we go. Two to zero. Susan, your third and final question. Get it right, we move on. Get it wrong, and you're back tomorrow morning for more exciting Battle of the Sexes on K105. Here's your question. Who is VJ Singh? VJ Singh, is that a golfer, a baseball player, or an indie car racer? VJ Singh? VJ Singh, you bet. Okay, golfer, an indie car racer, or what else? Baseball player. Golfer. Golfer? Yeah, that's exactly right. Hey, nice wow. work. Yeah, two to two. Bob, third and final question. Get it right, it's over. Get it wrong, and we move on to the bonus round. Here we go. Bob, which of these would you find in a Sephora store? Makeup, shoes, or crockery? What kind of store? Sephora. Or Sephora. Makeup, shoes, or crockery? Shoes. Mm, it's makeup. Oh, it's makeup. All right. Makeup. So, ah, two to two. That means we got to kill the music here because we are moving on to the bonus round, guys. Here's how it works. I'm going to ask you a question. Your name is your buzzer. The first person to yell out their name gets to answer the question. Get it right. You win Battle of the Sexes. Get it wrong, and the other person has a chance to answer. Your name is your buzzer. Here's the question. What do you put in your iced tea? Bob. Susan. Bob's in first. Nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing in my tea, dang it. Do you do Not the sweet nice. tea, Bob? Sure. All right, uh, here we go. Uh, congratulations, Bob. You are a winner, winner, chicken dinner. Right on, brother. Hey, these are nice gift certificates. You get $50 worth for the Whiskey Creek Wood Fire Grill in Kokomo. That's worth going to Kokomo for. And Susan, who is very entertaining, is back tomorrow morning for more Battle of the Sexes on K105.